Guys, I'm at the Barbarian Scaleplex setting up for the No Man Left Behind event that that guy right there is putting on. Hey! <laughs> you guys know Mr. Giggles. So he is going to be trying to test the course with my Class 1 uh, Trail Gladiator. So we're just simply, uh, if he can almost get this course, then we can almost get it. And you're already going the wrong way. Gate 2 is over there. Yep, got a crossover. Should I move the gate over here to make it easier? Probably so. Think so? <laughs> All right, well, hang on. Hold on a second. Right there. <laughs> All right, so set the gate over. This is why you test courses sometimes. Because you may envision one thing and then uh, something else not be right. Now, keep in mind, this is independent front suspension, all kinds of things. So if Sean can actually get close to clearing it then the course should be plenty easy enough sean is not very uh skilled with this truck either i'm not skilled with a truck period you're not skilled at all <laughs> <laughs> uh, that gate's a little narrow there guys no it's not that's it's plenty of room i could put a six by six through that oh. let it be not see i hit it that's yeah, not but, cool like, yeah, but you're on a really low slung class one there. All right, now you got to head over here, right up that. That could be a, quite a challenge. Well, if I do that, almost. Oh my god. That was pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, Lerner, it's not your truck. Okay, but this okay. is good for a better vehicle though. Yeah. Oh. We've done this line a bunch of times. Yeah. It's just not. It's slippery. Those tires are yeah. not dripping at all. Okay. Next, okay. Hand next to one. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now we got head over there. Okay. Yeah, that independent suspension will hang up. You gotta drive like you got an IFS car. And then the Almost. fact it's got those tires are only 3.82. So they're really small tires as well. They suck. <laughs> Where's my high racks tires when I need them? Where's your test truck? I have no test truck. Have you seen me crawl in the past few months? <laughs> no, oh, no, no, not gonna happen. Here you go. Ooh, I should have brought a Bronco. <laughs> no, 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 there you go. Ease around that point. There you go. My flag didn't count, I already passed it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, most every other truck is gonna be, you know, a big class two or something, right? Oh, this is just about. You gotta, grab that. you gotta bounce and get that belly across that. You're not gonna crawl it. What the hell is you <laughs> Okay, now I gotta crawl <laughs> Oh, yeah, Sean. That body had no scratches before you. Still doesn't have any scratches, just gouges. <laughs> <laughs> Well, nothing else. We're giving it a durability test, aren't we? Yes, we are. Wow, that bumper and all that. There you go. Yep. All right, so it's a little difficult for this truck, but I think it'll be all right, I though. Know. I think if someone else was driving, it probably. I don't like those tires at all. <laughs> Not for this wet condition. Yeah, it's wet, slick. They are uh, probably not the best. And then when you look at the truck, you know, there you go. Now you got to ease off, come all the way over here. I don't think that bumper's gonna let you do much with that. But you can do that all the way around. Going down the yes. That should be fun for these guys. Yeah. Probably blew all the leaves out. Got a pretty good drop right here. Stay 
you now, Joe. That gate's plenty wide. Plenty wide. Right. There you go. <laughs> you can tell I haven't driven in a long, long yes. time. <laughs> and this is supposedly going to be my number one USTE truck that I drive around all the time. Oh, really? What the game plan is, you're going to have to learn how to give it a light belly tap and get across that. There we go. <laughs> what servo you got in here? It's got the uh, Reef Triple Four. There's no BEC on it. Can you tell? Yeah. Every now and then. Yeah, this ain't going to happen oh, here. Oh, man. I told you, this is super slick. Oh, boy. <clears throat> now it's scratched. Yep, that's not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, I do not like that IFS front bumper <laughs> yeah <it's, laughs> that skin plate <laughs> it definitely leaves a lot to be desired you know <laughs> and just think for a while there i wanted to put the same ifs on the back probably would not have been a good performance thing um, probably wouldn't have. oh really it's a low class one. There you go. <laughs> you have to drive from underneath. When the nomad left behind, I, I, I predict I'm going to hear a lot of. <laughs> and big crashes. Crash. Yeah, it's going to be good. <laughs> Well, that IFS is so low, it's almost rubbing the hose the way it's set up on there. Just a little bit more work, and they could have got a lot more clearance out of that, you know? I think so. A lot more clearance. It is, yeah, it is. It's just so low hanging. I mean, the, uh, what is it? The, uh, that other IFS truck that came out way before this. Ooh! <laughs> I forget the name of it. Was it Balosi? I forget. Yeah, I forget too, but they had that one set up with plenty of clearance at the, on the uh, oh, IFS. Look at that. Oh, really? <laughs> It's a seven foot wide gate. Eight to two and wide, you got Joe. both sides. Well, I had to hit the other side. I had to hit the other side. Both sides. Hit you too close, Joe. There you go. <laughs> All right. And on the second course, let's see what Sean can do here. You're going to have to be a lot more to the right. To get that belly over. Let me try that again. Try it again? Let me try it again. All right. This, it's easy. You just got to hunk, get a little bit closer to that white flag over there. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. That's why I want to try it again. <laughs> So much hang up on the front. Now we just got up around here. The dirt should be pretty easy. Oh yeah. Got a nice easy gate six over here. I'm gonna try to hug it around, but we'll see. No, come back, come back, Jay, come back. <laughs> oh, I try to be, I try to be technical, but I don't think I'm gonna be. <laughs> now you back off and give it a running start. Oh, man. <laughs> There's going to be a lot of that action going on. Yeah. <laughs> now we have the wood bridge over here. 
I'm probably gonna have to add some dirt down yeah. there. Yep. That's kind of washed out Actually, pretty bad. I don't know. With the class twos, I think it'd be all right. You think so? Yeah. Now these tires, when you get to the back, that kind of a clay sand type mm -hmm. area, when they pack up like that, they actually gain traction. I don't know how they do it, except for that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm saying now. Uh, yeah, just go ahead and uh -huh. yeah, got that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how that, I was in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> All right through. I guess you got to straddle two of the straps to stay on. Oh, another slick one. Oh, yeah, they're sliding back. Ooh. All right, let's try that. Well, one thing for sure is getting a Sean Larman durability test. There you go. Oh, we got to fix this. What, what, fix? Oh, yeah, we're going to repair that. Fix that. Yeah, flag. Really? Dude, I saw a guy hit the flag and it stood up like that and actually rolled the truck over. <laughs> the flag. <laughs> Straddle <laughs> <laughs> the T straps. Straddle the T straps. There you go. I believe we can get a CCO one across this. Now this right here, you we got have. It. What are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah, flag's too close. Too close. Tons of room. Whatever. Look at that. See? <laughs> Plenty of room. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta already straighten some gates. Now you gotta go way over there. This might be a little bit much. Over here? Yep. Yeah, this might be a bit much. You think so? Well, we'll see. No, I think you can go to the right of the gate. Oh, look at that. Piece of cake. Now you got those two over there, crossing the bridge. Nice dirt. Oh. Well, that wasn't the exactly way. the game plan that I had in mind, but. <laughs> <laughs> it worked <laughs> all right they got all the way over there with the bridge then we're going to come back on maybe some harder stuff over here that's a nice little bridge jim built nice and wide so we can walk through that one yeah it's supposed to be all like that joe <laughs> Some kind of challenge. I ain't going up them stairs. <laughs> yeah. All right, now you got to turn right. Oh, hmm. down the hill. Uh huh. There you go. Left. Come under the pipe. Is there a gate there? Nope. I did not put any gates on the out of pipes. The tires are clogged pretty well. There you go. Now you got to go through the little tunnel, mm -hmm. down, around, and then you'll finish up right across the top. Ooh, be oh, well, you got to put concrete on it, so it should be all right. Yeah, shouldn't be a problem. Except for that. Except for that. So pretty much as the day goes on and everything dries out, the course is just going to get easier. That's if we don't have any rain. <laughs> well, they're not talking about rain until... Uh, In the evening. Yeah. Oh, come on. You can make it up there. I know it can go. There you go. And now we're going to finish off with the final game. With a triple gainer. <laughs> triple gainer. There we go. <laughs> so Sean, what do you think? The course is okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think some places you have to widen the flags. Widen the flags. Yes, widen the flags. Okay, I'll do what I can. <laughs> <laughs> that was Mr. Giggles, aka Sean Larmer. We haven't seen him in a while. He was there, put him on it, beat the heck out of my poor little truck. But that course was a little bit rough for it, you know, and he hasn't driven in quite a while, so Anyway, it did survive. Uh, we feel the course is plenty good enough, so it is what it is. Now, in that description, you guys know what's coming, right? A-Main, eBay, Amazon, Red Cat, and Walmart. Even though nobody uses the Walmart link. Jeez. Click that thing once. 
Anyway, uh, those are our affiliate links. Use those to check out. And right now, with it being Christmas season, well, it might be worthwhile to use those links if you don't have a local hobby shop. So, anyway, use those links. Check out with whatever you've got. Uh, if you like what I'm linking up, just check out with that. Anyway, guys, check that description. Use those links. Make sure you're subscribed. And thank you all for watching. If you guys like what you see, make sure you're subscribed. Hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. If you really, really like what you see, consider clicking on that join button down below. With that, you can actually become a channel member. Members get early viewing of many of the videos. And, you know, a little bit more personalized. Guys, thank you all for watching.